See, I don't really personally watch too many reality shows. I think it just makes a whole bunch of people just look bad. Make them look bad? Well, yeah, because, like, I think, you know, if, if you think about, like, reality shows, as far as, you know, what celebrities and other people do, they, they, they curse your life. Yeah. Because, um... I think anything you probably do on that reality show gets overshadowed by any work you do as an individual. You know what I'm yeah, yeah, like through uh, because if you go through like some kind of drama and everybody know your business. Yeah, and, and, and you uh like do like the um go to like the dag on. Say if I were to start a reality show and get into a fight with somebody and and, I, and then I drop an album the next month, that album still be overshadowed. But but the, the, uh, that that be overshadowed by the fight. You get stuck in that. You get stuck in that that, that, that look. Everybody looks at it from that reality side. You would. They, they can't see it the other way. I mean, at the end of the day, people see you as how they want to see you as. They don't yeah. see you for who you are. As who you really are as a person. But still, right. it, it's, it's 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 like it's just retarded. To, yeah. Cause, so I don't I don't think I would do no no, no reality show BS like that. Nope. I mean, I, I don't mind drama. It makes for good TV. But like at the same time, you know. What, what, where's the if it's nothing but drama I kind of like how uh, Donald Trump said that there's fake news you know what I'm talking about yeah that's it if, uh, you know what I would love to see a, 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 a reality show with, uh, with, with Granny here <laughs> <laughs> for real I would of all people I would love to see the uh, episode of the merch she tells the people that she burned her mom's cat alive in the oven oh yeah <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna turn it on. When they bounce, stop bounce. Screams, yell, bounce all around. Damn, ruthless. And I just took them, rage them out, throw them away. Why am I telling them? Don't say that. Do the skin did taste to see how it tastes. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do all you, Charles. Everything y'all have to do, I'm gonna do it for you. Okay, okay. Car, car grow up. <clears throat> Come on, get it going. Well, it's well, I'm pretty sure your mom loved that cat, though. I don't care whether they love them or not. They should have cleaned the shit up. <laughs> 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 You're like, I have, I cleaned up that, after that cat no that more. Was, Someone got to die. That, I wasn't the only child. Wait. Why didn't they call some of that? Mm. Mama had seven children. <laughs> Back, they called them like that. I have ever seen that uh, that uh, one dude that uh, accidentally killed himself trying to clean his gun? No, I never saw that. Turns out he was uh, trying to clean his gun. Yeah. A pastor, I think. Pastor. Yeah, a pastor was trying to clean his gun, and uh, he uh, he shot himself accidentally. But who who tries to clean a loaded gun? First of all. Yeah. Crazy person. <laughs> he was a pastor. Mm -hmm. Still was crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. You're gonna mess with a gun, you make sure even when you got the bullets out, shake. One might have got stuck. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, actually, if it, if it was stuck, the chamber probably would have just, you know. It was jammed. Yeah, exactly. The, cha the chamber would have jammed, so. Uh, yeah. I Even up. when the safety's on, you know what I'm talking yeah. about? Yeah. Uh, one day he didn't kill himself. He did kill himself. He did? He did kill himself. Oh, man, I'll tell you. Oh, one of these home by himself. Who is? Whoever it was that killed himself. Or some pastor, but I think you would know about crazy. I mean, did did I mean did, did, didn't you slice your husband wide open? <laughs> huh? Didn't you did, didn't you slice your husband wide open? No, like, I just. <laughs> so, so so you didn't slice him wide open. You just I just that might have been he at the wrong place. But after I thought about it, I should have got both of them. <laughs> Oh my god. But she had the nerve to come to me. This guy was my other boyfriend in the end. Did you uh, come in the back? Yep. Yeah. So I just got a boy. I said, oh yeah, I'm just waiting.
just a second. I'll never forget that beautiful nightgown I had red and black. Okay. I said, oh, wait just a minute. Look over the drawer, I got that big, big butcher knife, like the uh, Denise got that big wide one. So you went pretty much Freddy Cougar on this day. <laughs> I, I wasn't playing on that. I just didn't take no mess when I was young. OG, definitely OG. Uh, I'm old somebody. You <laughs> <laughs> didn't play with me. Maybe that's why I just didn't bother with nobody. I was, if it was a loner, I was one. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it, it's best not to buy somebody. If people kind of find that weird nowadays, people who just don't like to bother nobody or just, you know. It's, and to me, it's better that way. It's just, it's just like, it's that real introvert you problem. Know, you don't I'm, have to I'm a, Yeah, I'm a, like, I'm an introvert because I'm like, I, I, don't, I, don't, I like, I don't, I enjoy my being by myself sometimes, but like, but I, like, you know. I can, I can do it every day. <laughs> every day. Every day. Every day. I can sit up and think. About different things instead of having somebody sit there, yak and yak, yak. yak. Or the phone, <laughs> the phone rang. Oh, Lord, that's it. Oh, wait, man, I got to tell you this. What I got, I just didn't want to be back with it. Yeah. And I wasn't mean, never mistreated nobody. And just leave me alone. I'm just having some people. Yeah. How old were you when you first got married? Me? Yeah. Fifteen. Fifteen? Mm -hmm. You were fifteen? My mother got home that night before bed. I got in bed with my mother. My mother said, I need you So I ain't got no husband. Well, you say you ain't never been in love before. No, never. <laughs> that sets back down and all the rest of it. I love. <laughs> I was going to knock Manuel with this. I was going to knock Manuel. The field told me, Mama, don't do that. The field, no, I, I just don't play. Mm. Yeah, the stabbing people that make it animals alive, I, it's, <laughs> I, 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 I assumed you wouldn't be playing. No, I don't play. <laughs> no. <laughs> that, that's the uh, well. That old lady sat down and looked at that TV. Yeah. yeah, but now see, look, I have a question. Um, what, like, was that an actual decision, or were you forced into marriage? My, my, my grandmother, my mother's side, she was uh, married off. At when she no, was, uh, I, I married to be my own boss. Okay. Well, I remember uh, one time my uh, Ivory, the one that's home, living now, ninety some years old, and she uh, wanted me to go back with her because she lived in Bugger Lucy, her and her husband, you know. Ah. Went through this and I don't think that's that there but she should help. So from that day on I put in my mind, I said, well, the first person asked me to marry, I will marry. Really? Mm-hmm. And I told her, I said, well, that's not about her. Ah, honey. <laughs> Got rid of him too. He was this he was stationed at four billion job. Well, you gotta say the people who uh, who actually uh, you know get or get married at a very young age like you do. But yeah, but you got a reason. You got to go through three or four people before you go somewhere. Huh. I'm tired of that shit. <laughs> <laughs> I heard that, Mark. This is right. I didn't have nothing to do with the kids when the school the whole time I would say something when I asked them young and after they found out they'd be running to me the young men's going to high school. I ate the book was what I said. Said, Yeah yeah. Shit. I I'd either take them down on Rampart Street and have dinner with them or something. Yep. Had a wonderful life. Wonderful life. Definitely one hell of a life. I could say. One hell of a life. Yeah, that's right. Still have them. <laughs> Still have them. Still have them. 88, yeah, 89 on the way. Yeah.
Yep. I was, I was a free hearted person. Kids used to, young ladies used to come. Where's I want to go somewhere? You have something that in the way. My brother be, was in the David. He'd been sending me some package, package, and I wouldn't be even open. Mm -hmm. you know, I said, girl, look that fine, see what you want. And I bring it back. I've always been free hard. When my brother got me that uh, radio, big tall radio, put the records on, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, 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 yeah. no, 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 No regrets. Never saw a hungry day. Can't say that I had to ever go bad for it. Like some people say they used to. That's the reason I came, I guess the reason I came on, on the floor like I see people with no shoes, no socks. No, I, hey, man. I got to have something on my feet. Thank God, thank God. You have like how many kids in total? How many kids I had in, in total? 16. 16. 13. 16 in total. Yeah, 16. I got 13 living. And the doctor had to put the last one to sleep. Oh, wow. I never even got the word from I do know the priest came there and had a little conversation with me. But the doctor called a priest. And then he came back in here and told me. That's the trip. My stubble who got the finish. The baby just sleep to save you. He said, but if you'd have had you either two or three kids, we'd put you to sleep. I never forget that. myself having more than two person. That gang still come around? That gang? That gang, they still come around? Oh, you're talking about the freeloaders. Freeloaders, that's what I call them. Uh, <laughs> you call them the freeloaders. The freeloaders. The freeloaders. The freeloaders. The freeloaders. <laughs> and I thank your mothers. They say they save food that way. <laughs> you don't let your kids come to my house every weekend and stay and go back that Sunday eat and shh. Yes, but uh, <laughs> too much. <laughs> don't they clean at home? Don't they do nothing? Hey, well, you know it's. Uh, I mean, don't you have another time that you can go around on the weekend? Hmm. No, because them people have sense. We <laughs> hmm? going where it's easy. Just lay around and eat, and sleep, and lay. Up. I think it's too much for me too, man. I personally couldn't go in. You know, it's all right to come to somebody's house every now and then. But just every weekend, you know, you got mm -hmm. <laughs> laying around this way, one laying over there. Yeah, they all got them in. Mm -hmm. I always blame Dale for going in that, that, the Air Force. Mm -hmm. Is it the Air Force he's going in? No, they're going to the Marines. Marines, I mean. They go, yeah, he was also going to the Marines. I'm, I'm skeptical about him going into in the Marines now that Trump's in office. You know what I mean? Why? Because, yeah, I'm scared of losing another brother. No, I don't think uh, I don't think I uh, won't. Uh, yeah, I think a good chance to have a war. Very good chance. What's up, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? They do it all the time. Republicans always have war. They always have war. Democrats, they've had, 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 they've had,
If it's time for your brother to go, he going if he stay here. If that man up there got him numbered. Yeah. He can go. Yeah. No. That'll be just fine. He going what? Somebody going to learn him. It's time to get out of bed. Out there exercising. <laughs> he going to the right place. In a bunch of serves he going, he going to the right place. So you let Brother Dale go right on. Damn, he blowing gas. Oh yeah, Man, blowing some gas. Like shit. You hear those headers in there, boy. Slow. You hear that wah wah wah. Open it up, man. I hope a cop pull him over. I hope a cop pull him over. Yeah. Because unless somebody is sick. Yeah, well, I don't call police on nobody. <laughs> you don't run that fast. Right. I just think, personally, I don't call police on nobody. No, no I wouldn't call nobody on it. I say, I wish you was on this highway and see him. <laughs> he don't have nobody in his car going, no doctors or hospital. You just driving on the highway and flying like that. That's why they have some accidents, yeah. Yeah. You don't know how to drive as it is. And well, you know, it's just that 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 that, 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 that is some what true. It's all true. The, 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 but the, no, that's for the police go. Did you see that um that one video on the news where the uh, where they had a whole bunch of minority police together and the one and they said they tell you this to your face. Go to the black and Hispanic communities and they just pick on them. I never saw that. You never saw that? Mm -hmm. I'll, 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 I'll show you. I'll show you. It's just crazy. Well, but if he was killed, I don't think I'd want none of my kids to be a policeman. Yeah. No. Some police are just extremists in suits. I think some of them just get, would be a uh, police so they can have Speak, raise your voice. Yeah. They're, they're supposed to be public servants. I, I like to look at cops. On sun, that's on Sunday, huh? Mm -hmm. and jokers be running, cops thrown down on the ground. Put your hands behind your back and act like you don't want to do it. It's just, Black man got his house in good shape when they were going by. He figured they weren't going to I'm going to take his line, so he fixed that house. I know he got it rented out. Right, but you know, kind of like, kind of like I was saying, see, Charlotte isn't for, isn't for kids. It's, 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 it's a grown people town. Mm -hmm. It's like, like there's not just like a, there are like four strip clubs on one street. Four strip clubs on one street. Yeah. Well, that, well, they're not not the same street, but they're, they're, it's not roughly a mile away from each other. Four strip, they, four strip clubs. They're not even a mile away from each other. Uh, I guess they figured they love it somewhere to put it up there. <laughs> yes. Yeah, just uh, strip clubs and like regular clubs. First car is a Cadillac. My first car, oh yeah. I, I didn't pick it. My, 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 yeah, my, God, God both did. God right? did. Met me two days after he bought me a new Cadillac. Didn't tell me nothing. Bought you a yeah, Cadillac after two days after you met you. Yeah. yeah he uh, had just came overseas. Korea War. He had money. No, he had to go get He had been paid since he'd been there. He hadn't been paid since he'd been there, but he still bought you a car. Yeah. But he had just came from war. Ah. And he went to get paid. When he came back, he told me, go to the, go look down the, out the window. And I said, uh, out the window? What am I look out the window for? Doing you know, dinner head hair like this. I went to the window and looked. Came back and said, I don't see a thing out that guy. He 
go back and look, you got to see something about that. Because my mind, I wouldn't even think about no car. Uh, okay. I went back and looked again. He said, you don't see a white Cadillac right under the window of your cousin's house. I said, oh yeah. He said, I bought that for you. Wow. Yeah. How romantic. <laughs> I met him that night. He came by the next day. He went to go get paid and came back. Hmm. Wasn't no sex involved either. Well, he was just that good looking pretty woman with all that long pretty hair. And what do I have, man? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're going through chemotherapy, you always. Yeah, it's gone. The hair's gone. Yeah, it's gone. Should, I ain't buying a weed. Nice body, by the way, huh, man? I've never been a funny person. I never used lipstick. I never used no kind of makeup. On that. Everything you saw of me, that was natural. Hmm. Well, no phony, that. So. Shit. And if you people don't have the lipstick, and if they're going to use it, why don't they use it? I get somebody to teach me what color and how to put it on. <laughs> One black lady come on that TV and every time she, I see her, I say, Lord, I must want some of her friends. <laughs> yeah. and I bet you she looks 100%. She's not an ugly woman, but that lipstick runs. Really? Yep. Now at this point, she's like, the hell with lipstick. The change for the hell. That's for sure. Because yeah. she don't know how to put it out. And she, some people, they won't just tell you in a nice way, you know. Now don't put you with that. See her lipstick goes all under the air. The end of lipstick goes under the air. All that and all. Uh, mm -mm. Uh, well you, can, well, you can try to explain to that to me all you want. I'm not putting lipstick on. <laughs> nope. I'm never, not putting lipstick on. <laughs> never, 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 never used it. Yeah, I'm not putting, I'm not putting lipstick on. Perfume. Phil put lipstick? I said perfume. That's the nice thing. <laughs> I'm about to say, 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 i <laughs> you ain't got no better steak. What you gonna put the cereal on? I just been all bullied. Put put it that way. Mm, that's cool. Hey, you remember that one uh, that one clip on Once the Hip Hop I showed you about those one couple that was that were uh, that got caught in the McDonald's bathroom. <laughs> I heard of it. I don't. I didn't ever see it. I I I I, I, uh, sh I showed it to you. You seen it? That's just showed it to you. Just don't remember. I just don't remember. That. Yeah, they, they they got caught in, in the in the McDonald's bathroom. He was like, "Let's go! Open the door! Open the door!" Ain't <laughs> <laughs> hey, no way y'all should not be in the bathroom together anyway. Is it not a hotel? <laughs> this is a free room. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> he came out there with his shirt all off. Oh damn god! Now when you go back, you going back to work? Yeah. Thank you very much. I'm glad. I don't want to show you this uh, 